Sometimes in a math class, especially calculus, a regular graphing calculator isn't enough. You may need a calculator with a CAS, or computer algebra system, meaning the calculator can manipulate variables like X and Y. In this video, we take a look at the two most popular Texas Instruments calculators with a CAS, the TI-89 Titanium and the new TI-Inspire CAS. The TI-89 Titanium has been around longer meaning that it has a full complement of free apps available on the Texas Instruments website. As with most calculators, it comes with a removable cover for added protection. The back cover is easily removed to reveal the four AAA batteries that power the calculator and a small backup battery that is accessible with a screwdriver. At the top of the calculator there is an older style I.O. port as well as a USB input. These can be used to transfer files between calculators or to receive apps and operating system updates from TI. Once you go to the main calculator home screen, you can use the F1 through F5 keys to access a variety of drop-down menus. The interface is laid out in an easy to use and logical manner. A similar interface exists in the TI Inspire CAS. Generally speaking, we like the user interface of the TI-89. Even though the 89 series is almost as old as the original TI-83 series, it has a more modern and intuitive interface. It also has 3D graphing features, something not available on the Inspire CAS. That said, not everything is as easily inputted on a TI-89 as you might expect in a modern calculator. Here, a simple summation is inputted. As you can see, the user must know the right combination of inputs since the TI-89 doesn't load a template that can easily be filled in. Once entered, the summation does appear in math print format, but it's too bad that users can't enter it that way. We also wish that the trace feature incorporated finding max and min the way the newer TI Inspire CAS does. If you've used a TI-84 before, you won't have any trouble with the 89's graphing features, but it can be confusing for first-time graphing calculator users. The TI Inspire CAS comes in two versions, the newer touchpad on the left and the click pad on the right. Both have a USB port input. Their button layouts are different, but their capabilities and menus are the same. The other significant difference is that the touchpad has a removable keypad to access the batteries. The click pad does not, opting for a rear access panel. At this point, there are no other keypads available for the Inspire CAS. The feature set of the Inspire CAS is extremely similar to the TI-89. The user interface is different and we would argue better. Look at the same summation from before entered into the Inspire CAS. Syntax no longer needs to be memorized since the calculator loads a summation template that basically is a fill in the blanks. Other than the missing 3D capabilities, the Inspire CAS is also superior with graphing. It is very easy to find a maximum, minimum, or intercept since the trace feature finds them automatically. Considering how often those features are used in a calculus class, this is a significant advantage for the Inspire CAS.